Good afternoon, sir. We are extremely honored to have you with us today. It's a great privilege for us to spend this time with you, sir. How are you feeling among the young minds and future scientists, sir? No, it basically it, uh, always regenerates me. So for, uh, going back my younger days, it's nice. so bring uh, actually it brings me back to the schools and uh, you know, being young. I think Kalam used to tell like that. With the youngsters, you will be young, and you will become young also. Ah, yeah. I, think that I definitely feel like that. It is really meaningful, sir. It's really important for us. Sir, from your point of view, are we on the right track, sir? Is there any suggestion for you? What are the things do we have to develop and implement in our school to bring a lot of scientists and future tech engineers? Yeah, looking around the uh, uh, technosium uh, 20, 24, 25, yes. uh, 25, 26 yes. uh, in, in your uh, Sri Krish uh, school. Uh, my, my feeling is I think it is uh, uh, in the timely action is already in place. Okay, And for the all round improvement of the students are concerned. I think uh, they are given all the opportunities possible, uh, starting from regular curricula yes. and even the uh, upcoming uh, technologies like AI in a place without losing uh, focus on the extracurricular activities, uh, be it uh, language, be it uh, mathematics, be it uh, uh, fine arts and sports. I think everywhere I think a good, good amount of opportunities are there and good amount of mentors are with you. Uh, so, but, and uh, the way in which the students also uh, have shown so showcased a good amount of uh, exhibits. Uh, I, I think I'm seeing from the kindergarten to all the way no. third standard, fourth standard to eleventh. I, I think it's really uh, I, I see a good ecosystem which has been developed with that. Uh, I think it's in a good direction. Uh, both the school, the students, as well as the parents also. Yeah. I could see the parents also with a lot of enthusiasm they are there part of that. I think it's a very right, right, right path system is moving. It means a lot to us to receive an appreciation from you, sir. Sir, our students are really big dreamers, but they get distracted using gadgets and technology. How can the young generation balance these gadgets as well as they can move towards their dreams? I think the positive steps what you people have taken is how the AI and the gadgets can come together. I think yeah. that's what yeah. the exhibits are there. And uh, that, that's how it is being there. So that's really look at here. The positive aspects, aspects of the characters, the positive aspects of the technology. If you come together, and that is how uh, we have to uh, ensure that. So you look at here, uh, the knife is there. Knife is there to cut the apple also. Yeah. But knife is there to harm somebody else also. But as long as you are clear, the knife I'm going to use it for, uh, for my purpose for the uh, kitchen nets or cooking. Uh, you are well and good. I think the, the direction is very good. Uh, without uh, because with the technology, we have definitely we have to assimilate. Or else we will be lagged behind. Uh, for that, you take the technology and proceed in a positive way. I think that is the real, real uh, mantra which you have. I feel your school is taking that steps. In it's practice, really meaningful sir. and practical, sir. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you, sir. As your uh, school slogan, today's children are tomorrow's leader. What message would you like to leave for young leaders, sir? Okay, basically today you look at here, uh, across the world, uh, uh, the nations are getting more and more world. Even the China, the Japan, uh, European countries, you look at here, the more world population has come and they becoming old and the, because of that, uh, uh, even Japan, once upon a time it was leading in the world, it is going back. Uh, China, it's already seeing its signatures. But whereas uh, India is concerned, India will be the younger population for quite some time. I think this should... And we should learn the lessons from there, so that this younger population uh, should take the opportunity to take the next generation and uh, again use the opportunity to lead the world. I think th th we are in a transition. The world world is a transition and uh, India is in a very, very good situation where in next 20, 30 years we are the younger population. But this younger population should take care of the next generation, older generation yeah. also in the years to come. So this is the this is how if we go, then the world is in our camp. Yes. Okay. Yes. I think that, that is the that is the uh, situation I feel. Thank you so much for coming to Sri Krish for Thank inaugurating you. our technosium and as well as encouraging our students because when you are coming and uh, encouraging our students, it does mean a lot because they will also have a spread of uh, inspiration of become scientists. So we need it's in India in need in future because, because what is the experience and when you. As working as you are the first person showing to India, taken to the 
ఇట్లా అని చెప్పి ఆ ట్రూ ప్లమ్ సెవెన్ కదా యు ఆర్ ద ఫస్ట్ పర్సన్ టేక్ ఇన్ ఇండియా అండ్ వెరీ ప్రైడ్ ఇప్పుడు సార్ ఎక్స్పీరియన్స్ సెవెన్ బాగా ఇదే నా ఎక్స్పీరియన్స్ మీన్స్ డెఫినెట్లీ ఐ థాట్ వన్స్ ఎంటర్ ఇన్ దిస్ స్పేస్ ఈజ్ వన్ ఆఫ్ ద గోల్డెన్ ఆపర్చునిటీ నాట్ మెనీ పీపుల్ హ్యాడ్ దెన్ ఆఫ్ కోర్స్ ఎస్ హౌ బెస్ట్ యూ కెన్ మేక్ యూ సార్ ఎస్ ఐ థింక్ దట్స్ హౌ ఈవెన్ దో వెన్ ఐ జాయిన్ ద ఇస్రో వాస్ ఎ వెరీ వెరీ మాడస్ట్ బట్ మై ఈవెన్ మై స్కూలింగ్ ఆల్సో వాస్ మాడస్ట్ the inspector of the marast school i could compete at that level so nothing should stop from uh, where i joined isro to take it up further uh, i think we have taken a bit good good spirit we have gone ahead and uh, the nation also supported us in a good form uh, putting that together we made an opportunity we made use of an opportunity and shown to the world given the opportunity india is second to none in any field uh level even even the rocket science also we can do i think that is uh, one side we shown to the world we have done and another side we have shown to back in our own india also we we also can do a lot more uh, even the cutting edge technologies are uh, the putting the things together i think everything has come in a very good form uh, but having taken the opportunities and the challenges uh, together uh, in a nice way we have gone and uh, definitely it is a uh, uh, end of the day you look at here it is really really <coughs> Uh, fully satisfied uh, uh, the thing i am having so that's why i am trying to give back to the country what has given me an opportunity whatever may be the way possible so the giving back is not in terms of money i think i can if i are able to kindle even one or two minds per day i think that's that's more than enough things so many people are cutting opportunity but they are not utilizing properly <laughs> but you utilize properly and given the brand uh, yeah. india and as well as to become famous man in the country yeah. so how do you feel that even after retirement you are not tired and you are not sitting at home you are roaming everywhere and uh, giving a lot of lectures and uh, because you know you are helping the people of young minds how do you feel how you are able to cope up with this uh? no you look at the another thing also now the longevity of the people have gone up okay one longevity means it's a productive life of the people also is high so you just telling productive life of the people also high uh, how you really you can make use of the your life very productively i think the, i i i want to see the in some telling to somebody else why, what i can do i think that is that is what i, I am taking forward uh, so i am uh, uh, like what nisro saturday sunday used to with this, this uh, school children uh, college uh, students it's a similar thing i am following but still monday to friday i am working for any other fields computer uh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah and that to cutting edge technologies like green hydrogen and waste to wealth and uh, health care what technology can use these are all the cutting edge technologies even the world world is looking and uh, uh, even though i retired uh, but by 36 years of experience back in uh, space arena uh, i thought i can i can use it in a much better way and uh, uh, when when these two two goes together that means you, you, you if you, uh, in a longer life span you should to work in a meaningful life to make the meaningful life your life span should be productive yeah. to be productive you have to engage yourself If you engage yourself, you will continue to be young. I think this is the uh, 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 thing that resonates with me and that's why I am... There are many that. scientists retired or many other professions that are retired. After retirement, they are all simply sitting at home, they are relaxed and they don't know what to do. But you are not doing that because you are really engaging the people throughout India. And more and more you are sharing the knowledge. So that means yeah, you are creating yeah, I, more insight. I, I, actually, I, I, I refuse to retire. I I refuse to retire. Nobody can retire me. <laughs> I feel... <laughs> Yes, the job yes, can yes. be different so yes. retirement is more of a, more of a refreshment for me yes. that's what i feel there are new uh, jobs new opportunities new avenues are available so why to sit back in the home uh, why can't you refresh yourself and uh, uh, that is the that's why kalam used to tell holidays are not meant for to re- you sleep holidays are meant for you to refresh yourself yes. i think that's what retirement also is happening for me there are retirement was you are helping india to yeah, grow right. lot of people you are taking the india in always you know wherever you go you smile some another means it's a grace <laughs> it's a grace everywhere the grace is there what do you feel as a chairman of the school what other thing i have to do here to implement here take our school towards helping society as a towards the india towards uh, introducing young scientist in our schools no it's a really heartwarming to see uh, 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 because before coming out to your campus uh, I happen to give an yeah, award to your, your, your kids when they <laughs> came for the state level uh, the science exhibition, uh, science uh, uh, competition there. Uh, so then I, I'm able to see uh, the same young kids are uh, you know, <laughs> yes. start up. In the school yeah. level, they are a start up and they are thinking about uh, agriculture, what we can do, society we can do. 
uh, i think that that means the ecosystem here is very good yes, so first and foremost the ecosystem is to be preserved yes, sir. okay preserved and uh, taken it forward there so uh, that is the one thing second thing is definitely uh, you are all uh, already in the path of like what what ai can do yep, and how sir. ai can be taken yes, care sir. how the gadgets can be used in a very positive way yes, i think these, these are all the things are already in a place uh, possibly you can think about uh, bringing this because i used to tell about that uh, science has to work for vivasaya model vinvali kar yes of course okay. yeah, you are agricultural right. to astronomy so, uh, 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 yes. science has to work that yes. uh, so one side let us uh, look at that also what modernization what agriculture is needed uh, to make sure that it not only for the space or uh, uh, computers or ai youngsters have to go even agriculture if, if we make the area in a much better way uh, ecosystem is better uh, the people will go towards that also because there is a possibility of being to be an entrepreneur in the agriculture good number of youngsters possible so that that also we are able to imbibe it's good yes one side we can to space technology but another side we can talk about even agriculture also what sort of modernization we can do so that the ecosystem is there that ecosystem encourages the youngsters to work there i think that that is the thing we can think about. so you feel that we have to create more professional but still you wanted to have more entrepreneurs exactly yeah, exactly i think that that, that 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 i think is uh, uh, i feel that that is really a call to her uh, because uh, 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 we need not next generation of the people need not go seeking for the job outside yeah that's what i feel they, they can be an entrepreneur here if required let people come here yeah. to uh, yeah. for their <laughs> job i, I think, think that should be the uh, thing for the next I generation is coming yeah. i mean in completely i i, I, I uh, fully agree creating agree. entrepreneur yeah, our exactly. student has yeah, to be yeah, entrepreneur yeah, yeah, yeah. the mini employee they should have yeah. across the field across the field across they should give employment for many yeah, exactly. people that is what yeah, exactly yeah. Yeah. and in the way they have become entrepreneur they can pay a lot of tax to country correct correct, correct. and they can create a lot of things yeah, exactly, so exactly. we also want so to they need that. not go from motherland to elsewhere yeah, they can do they it can here sir and the motherland also will grow in a better way <laughs> too, yeah. i think that that's that's the real so as you have visited our technosim today which project and what kind of project in, like uh, grab your attention which one you saw the most beautiful yeah first and foremost the way in which you approach the technosim itself is totally different so normally if we go there after inauguration we will go to the auditorium we will keep giving lectures and making the powerpoints and something like something like that uh, so then giving some awards or something like that uh, but here uh, i think the full time of mine uh, was utilized to, to showcase uh, what the kids have done all the way from kindergarten to the high school people have done that itself is uh, amazing and uh, i could see the uh, the number of uh, exhibits whatever is shown is is a yearly really overwhelming so that way first and foremost the way in which technology has been conducted the school itself uh, is totally different from what i have seen all along uh, then if picking up any one model I, i don't whether i can do it because a uh, good number of models i wish to see also <laughs> no. yes, okay so without without counting them telling others is uh, Market. but but one one good thing is uh, definitely uh, they have applied their mind and they have uh, done that and uh, while doing it yes there are the places where the parents also could have contributed but it's a team basically yes, it's a so team that people are doing but they are able to express it and uh, once you can do but they, most of them they are able to express what they have done that's also really really it's called one uh, that way look at that uh, definitely lot more has been happened there and the stem uh, uh, the lab yes, way in which it is uh, providing an opportunity for the youngsters with the building blocks are given so all are using uh, the even the the third standard fourth standard students that using the sensors arduino thing and python programming uh, uh, coming out the smart systems uh, is really really uh, yeah, heartwarming and uh, i see uh, starting from small uh, toy uh, all the way to the ai application i think they stretched a lot uh, i i i see a yeah, lot more lot more for the happen and uh, yes i told uh, even the startup uh, wow. some of the students are sitting there uh, that shows the bandwidth in which the people are working starting from the uh, thing to the that level yes, so that that is a very very encouraging it's a, a, a really a, a techno sim of a different kind i have seen yes, it's sir. fully practical rather than uh, on the yeah, uh, uh, auditorium whatever talk is there so i was not gone an opportunity to talk but i was uh, heavily interacted with the students so that's really a very interesting to see 
and the way in which they interacted, the way in which they answered, the way in which they demonstrated. Uh, I don't think so. It will not be fair for me to tell any one uh, <laughs> thing. Uh, <laughs> it's, uh, <laughs> Thank you so much, sir. Your journey really inspires us, sir, to dream big, work hard, and believe in ourselves. We are truly honored and proud to have you at Sri Krishna International School, sir. Thank you, Thank Thank you so you, much sir. for giving this Thank opportunity, you. sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you also for giving me an opportunity. Thank Look you, up sir. among the very, very positive aspect of the school and uh, with the youngsters and uh, looking uh, ahead, uh, whatever the we are thinking. Uh, I think we have youngsters with us uh, similar yeah. way. So I'm really, really happy to be part of. Uh, uh, today you are Techno Thank you, it's sir. Really, it really means a lot, sir. Thank you so much for coming, sir, and also having the interaction with us. It's a great uh, pleasure. Thank you, sir. Thank you, Thank you so much, sir. Great pleasure.